Hey guys, what's up? This is Hex, and in today's video for YesO for Beginners, I wanted to talk about Quick Key. Um, quick Keying, or it's also known, you know, some people also call it Hot Keying. Um, it's a way for a player to quickly access a particular item without having to really dig through the inventory. So, for example, let's say I'm in the middle of a world boss uh, fight, and I'm getting badly damaged. And I don't have any kind of magical heal, but I do have potions, so I want to get to that pretty quickly. You know, if I didn't have, you know, if you don't have quick key, what, what you would do is you have to actually go into your inventory, you know, and go into your slaughter biomes and, you know, get a potion that way. And let's be honest, no world boss is going to let you do that. Uh, with quick key, it makes things a lot easier because you can actually... Uh, run away from the monster a little bit and able to access that item pretty quickly. Now there's two different types of quick keen. There's one that's for items and collectibles and such and the other one is for emotes. So we're going to talk about emotes first. So in order to do uh, quick key your emotes you would just go into your social and into your uh, emotes and just choose which one you want to do. So for example, let's say I wanted to uh, choose eat soup. Um, so as you can see down the bottom, it has a button that's a, you know, for a sign. So that's the one you want to concern yourself with. So you just tap square and you come up and you, and it gives you this circle. And what you want to do now is just use your uh, left analog stick or L3 and just select which one that you want to, uh, you know either a place or just uh, you know if, or if you don't have anything there you know just put it in a particular spot and once you select what you want to do uh, you just let go of your of your left analog and tap X to assign and then you just go back out of it now to access your emotes you would just simply uh, you know hold down right on your d-pad and then with your right analog stick, choose whichever one you want to use. So I'm going to go ahead and select uh, Eat Soup. Let go of my uh, my right analog stick and then let go of my right uh, D-pad. And then it starts the animation. And if you want to select, the, you know, you, you know, any more, you know, you just do uh, exactly the same thing. You select. Uh, let go of your D-pad. And there you have it. Now for the other emotes, or excuse me, with the, for the other quick key uh, that pertains to stuff like, you know, your potions and your collectibles. Uh, in order to use that, what you want to do, let's say I want to quick key a potion. I just go ahead and go into my inventory, slotable items. And as you can see with these check marks, it means I've already got it uh, quick key. But for the sake of this demonstration, I'm going to go ahead and do it over. So I'm going to select uh, my potion, uh, tap square to assign, and then use my left analog stick to select where I wanted to put it. So I'm going to put it on the very top square. You know, let, let go of my left analog, then tap X, and there it is. Now it's going to be a little bit different to access this particular quick key because what you want to do first to select the potion you want to hold down on the up on your direct on your d-pad use your right analog stick to select the potion and then you know of course let go of your uh, right analog and then let go of your uh, of your up on your d-pad now, as you can see, it hasn't used it. All that means is I have it ready to go and I can use it as much as I want as long, you know, unless I change it. So, so let's say I'm in the middle of a battle. All I gotta do is just tap up on my D-pad and it uses my potion. As you can see on the bottom right, there's a timer for it. So if I try to use it again really quick, it won't let, or that or any other potion, it won't let me do that. Now I can, go ahead and select a, a, a collectible during this time you know just press up and then go ahead and let's say click uh, select crow's calling 
and then go ahead and tap up and do it that way. But in order for me to use that potion again, I'm going to have to make sure that that was the last thing that I selected. And, you know, just keep that in mind, you know, if you, if you, you know, select other things like your collectibles and you're going into battle, make sure that you do have, like, your potions or whatever you're going to use, you know, you know, selected and ready to go. But that's all I want to talk to you guys. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I hope to talk to you guys real soon. Take care.